Hello guys, welcome to Dogs Coffee YouTube channel. Today we are going to explain about immunization schedule. We have made it easy to memorize with mnemonics in this video. Immunization. Immunization is a process whereby a person is made resistant to an infectious disease typically by administration of a vaccine. Immunization schedule. At birth, three vaccines are given. They are BCG, Hepatitis B and Oral Polio vaccine. Coming to Hepatitis B, as I said before, the first dose is given at birth, second dose is given at 6th week, third dose is given at 10th week, fourth dose is at 14th week. Coming to Polio, the oral polio vaccine is given at birth as I said before. The inactivated polio vaccine first dose is given on 6th week, second dose is on 10th week, third dose is on 14th week. Coming to DTAP, Hip and Pneumococcal vaccine, these three vaccines have similar schedule. That is, first dose is on 6th week, second dose is on 10th week, third dose is on 14th week. D-TAP vaccine protects from diphtheria, tetanus, whooping cough. Hip vaccine protects from Haemophilus influenza B. Pneumococcal vaccine protects from pneumonia. Coming to rotavirus vaccine, it has two vaccines, RV1 and RV5. RV1 is given in two doses, RV5 is given in three doses. The first and second doses of RV1 and RV5 are on 6th week and 10th week. The third dose of RV5 is given on 14th week. MMR vaccine MMR vaccine is given in 3 doses. The first dose is on 9th month, second dose is on 15th month, third dose is at the age of 4 to 6 years. Varicella vaccine It is given as 2 doses. The first dose is on 15th month, second dose is at 4 to 6 years of age. Coming to Hepatitis A vaccine, it is given in two doses. The first dose is on 12th month, second dose is at the age of 16 to 18 months. If it is live attenuated vaccine, it is given single dose. If it is killed vaccine, it is given in two doses. Then coming to typhoid conjugate vaccine, which is given at 6 months of age to protect from typhoid. Then influenza vaccine from 6 months of age to 5 years. Benign influenza vaccine is started to giving after 6 months of age and it is given in 2 doses, 1 before 2 to 4 weeks of onset of season and the second dose at the onset of season and single dose yearly till 5 years of age. Then meningococcal vaccine, it is given in 2 doses with 3 months apart. MCV1 is given at 9 months of age and MCV2 is given at 12 months of age. For 2 to 55 years age, MCV single dose is enough. Then Japanese encephalitis, it is given in 2 doses. The first dose is given at 12 months of age and second dose is given at 13 months of age. Then Tdap vaccine, this is specifically for age above 7 years of child and it is given between 9 to 14 years of age. Then TD vaccine which is given between 15 to 18 years of age. Then human papilloma virus vaccine. It is given the first and second doses are given at 6 months of interval and for ages up to 14 years of age. This is given between 9 to 14 years. And HPV 1, 2, 3 doses are given for ages 15 and above and in immunocompromised children. This is given in 3 doses and the forms are 0, 1 to 2 and 6 months of age. Then cholera vaccine. Cholera vaccine is given. The first and second doses are given at 12 months to 18 years of age. 2 doses with 2 weeks apart for more than 1 year age and for individuals living in high endemic area and those who are traveling to areas where risk of transmission is very high. Booster vaccines. Inactivated polio vaccine booster is given at the age of 16 to 18 months. T-TAP booster is given at the age of 16 to 18 weeks, that is the first booster, and the second booster at the age of 4 to 6 years. Hip booster is given at the age of 16 to 18 months, and PCV booster is given at the age of 15 months. Then coming to mnemonics. Here there are few mnemonics to remember the immunization schedule in an easy way. So the first one is at birth three vaccines are given that is BCG, polio and hepatitis B. This you can remember in a form of BPH that is benign prostatic hyperplasia 
where the three letters representing you the three vaccines then the second mnemonic is remember dr h square p square in this there are six letters or six alphabets showing you the six vaccines that is dtac rotavirus hip pneumococcal hepatitis b and polio vaccine so as there are six alphabets in this the dosing of these six are scheduled at six week and in this the h and p are repeated so the duplicated h p are removed from this so there are four letters and this six is added with four making it as 10 and the next dose of these vaccines are scheduled on 10th week and this four is again added to the 10 making it 14 and the next dose is scheduled at 14 weeks of age so here finally the drhp that is dtap rotavirus hip and pneumococcal virus vaccines are scheduled with three doses each dose that is the first dose at six weeks of age second dose at 10 weeks of age and third dose at 14 weeks of age and the remaining hp that is hepatitis b and polio vaccines the first dose are given at birth itself so the second dose third dose and fourth dose are given at 6th 10th and 14th weeks respectively then the third mnemonic is mmr vaccine so this mmr vaccine you can remember this is given in three doses the first dose at nine months of age second dose at 15 months of age and the third dose three to four years so here the first dose you can remember in a way as there are two m's if you upright this m it appears as three as there are two m's three into three that is equal to nine so the first dose of mmr is given at nine months of age and coming to the second dose one m is uprighted and making it as three and the second m is added with two because this is the second dose we are giving so two plus three that is equal to five so three into five that is equal to 15 so the second dose of mmr is given at 15 months of age then coming to third dose of mmr this third dose is given between four to six years of age as the numeric value after three is four you can remember that mmr3 that is mmr third dose is given between four to six years of age then coming to varicella vaccine so this varicella vaccine is given in two doses the first dose is given at 15 months of age and this you can remember as varicella in common it is called as chicken pox and this is caused by herpes virus the word chicken pox is having 10 alphabets and the word herpes is having 6 alphabets but E is repeated in this so 1 E is excluded making it 5. So 10 plus 5 that is equal to 15 months. So varicella first dose is given at 15 months of age. Then varicella vaccine second dose is given between 4 to 6 years of age. So this you can remember in a way like V is bent to right and an imaginary line is drawn which appears as 4. So this you can remember like varicella vaccine second dose is given between 4 to 6 years of age. Then coming to hepatitis vaccine. Hepatitis vaccine is given at 12 months of age. This you can remember with the word hepatitis A1 which is having 11 alphabets as the numeric value after 11 is 12. So hepatitis A1 vaccine is given at 12 months of age. That is the single dose for live attenuated hepatitis A vaccine is given at 12 months of age. Then coming to TCV vaccine that is typhoid conjugate vaccine. This is given against typhoid and this is given at 6 months of age. So this you can remember with the word S typhi. That is nothing but salmonella typhi. As you all know typhoid is caused by salmonella typhi organism. This you can remember with S typhi which is having 6 alphabets. So TCV vaccine is given at 6 months of age. Then coming to 
influenza vaccine influenza vaccine is given between 6 months to 5 years this you can remember as the word influenza is having nine alphabets and this is given to protect from flu or this is given to remove flu the flu is having three alphabets as this is given to remove flu nine minus three that is equal to six so this influenza vaccine is given between six months to five years of age then coming to meningococcal vaccine so this meningococcal vaccine is given in two doses that is the first dose at 9 months of age and second dose at 12 months of age so here you can remember with the word meningeal which is having nine alphabets in that so the first dose of meningococcal vaccine is given at 9 months of age and the second dose this meningeal is added with the name of the vaccine that is meningococcal vaccine that is mcv which is having three alphabets in that so 9 plus 3 that is equal to 12 so the second dose of meningococcal vaccine is given at 12 months of age then coming to japanese encephalitis vaccine so this japanese encephalitis vaccine is given in two doses the first dose at 12 months of age and second dose at 13 months of age so this you can remember the first dose with the word encephalitis which is having 12 alphabets in that showing you like you can remember so this is given at 12 months of age then the second dose you can remember with the word j encephalitis as this is japanese encephalitis it is easy to remember as j encephalitis which is having 13 alphabets in that so this is given at 13 months of age that is the japanese encephalitis second dose is given at 13 months of age then coming to tdap tdap vaccine is given between 9 to 14 years of age this you can remember in a way like tdp chandrababu naidu has ruled andhra pradesh for about 9 years before separation to telangana and after separation he ruled about 5 years so starting with 9 9 plus 5 that is equal to 14 ending with 14 this t dap is given between 9 to 14 years of age then coming to human papilloma virus this is given in two doses with 6 month interval below 14 years or 14 years of age so this you can remember with the word papilloma which is having nine alphabets showing you 9 years and the word virus which is having five alphabets so making 9 plus 5 that is equal to 14 so you can remember that hpv first and second doses for children below 14 years or 14 years of age can be given between 9 to 14 years and for children above 15 years of age this human papilloma virus vaccine is given in three doses that is 15 to 18 years of age it is given between 15 to 18 years of age so you can remember that the next number of 14 is 15 as this is given at 15 years of age 15 plus and it is given in three doses so 15 plus 3 that is equal to 18 so hpv first second and third doses for age above 15 years are given between 15 to 18 years of age then coming to cholera vaccine that is first and second doses are given between 12 months to 18 years here you can remember cholera one two doses so one two leaving comma you can write one two together making it as 12 so 12 months to 18 years of age then coming to mnemonic for boosters so the first one is inactivated polio vaccine booster is given between 16 to 18 months of age this you can remember with the word inactivated boost 
which is having 16 alphabets in that and added with er that is booster making it 18 that is 16 plus 2 so you can remember that inactivated polio vaccine booster is given between 16 to 18 months of age then dtp dtp vaccine the first booster it is given in two doses the first booster is given between 16 to 18 weeks and second booster is given between 4 to 6 years of age so here you can remember for the first booster remember the alphabet p in dtp as p is the 16th alphabet you can remember the first booster is given between 16 to 18 weeks and for booster 2 remember the alphabet d in dtp so d is the fourth alphabet so you can remember that dtp second booster dose is given between 4 to 6 years of age here you can remember it in a crisscross manner that is for the first booster remember the last letter in dtp that is the p and for the second booster remember the first letter in dtp that is the d then coming to hib that is haemophilus influenza b booster is given between 16 to 18 months of age this you can remember with the word influenza vaccine which is having 16 alphabets in that so hib booster is given between 16 to 18 months of age then coming to pneumococcal conjugate vaccine booster is given at 15 months of age and this you can remember with the word pneumoconjugate which is having 15 alphabets in that showing you 15 months so pcv booster is given at 15 months of age thank you if you feel this video is informative like it share with your friends and subscribe for more videos